there YouTube! Welcome to the mess that is my room right before I move. Today we're not talking about moving, today we're talking about YouTube! So last week I went to the YouTube Creator Day event in Washington DC and it was so cool. I got to meet a ton of other local YouTubers and there were people there from YouTube who kind of gave us a little talk on what to do to make our channel better, collaboration, things like that. Some of the information I did already know just from like doing the Creator Academy online or just being around on YouTube for as long as I have, but today I'm going to share with you five things that I learned at YouTube Creator Day. Number one, even big YouTubers have their worries and problems. I know sometimes I look at people who have a hundred thousand subscribers or a million subscribers and I think they don't have any worries, they're fine, they're gonna do great. They're doing great, they have everything in order, they don't have anything to worry about. It always feels like they are so confident in what they are doing on YouTube. We did get a little Q&A panel with some larger YouTubers. It was Alejandra TV and the Super Cartland Brothers. They talked about some of the things that they worry about. It's a lot of the same worries that I have as a YouTuber, just kind of on a larger scale. So it's nice to know that we're all thinking about the same thing no matter how many subscribers we have. Number two, it's really fun to hang out with YouTubers. Hanging out with a group of people who kind of speak the same language as you is really awesome. I love all of my regular group of friends, but just sometimes I want to talk really deep in about YouTube and just nobody really understands me. But being in a room with a bunch of other YouTubers who understand what I mean when I say branding or channel trailer or things like that, I can have like YouTube discussions with other YouTubers and it's so good and I really liked the networking aspect of this event because it was so much fun. Number three, going along with the other one, the community around you might be larger than you think. I knew of some YouTubers in this area but I didn't think there were that many. At the Creator Day event there were some people from out of state but a large amount of them were from the DC, Virginia, Maryland kind of area and I had no idea that there was such like diversity of channels or people in the YouTube community in my immediate area. I know I probably should have realized that but just seeing it there is like a really good confirmation of what the community around me is like. Number four, you have to push through the hard stuff. Being a YouTuber is a ton of work and if you want to be successful you have to work really really hard and I know this is the same for everything but just another one of those things where seeing it and hearing it how hard you have to work and how rewarding that hard work is going to be later is just really inspiring and encouraging. Even these YouTubers that had like 500,000 subscribers each uh, that were on the panel, they still have to work super hard every single day to grow their channel and keep their channel up so just knowing that we're all in it together is just really nice. All in this together. Number five is know your value. You definitely have it, you just have to find it. This is something I'm struggling with but this event really kind of put this question is what is my value into my head and I'm constantly thinking about it trying to find the answer. Things I'm thinking about is like what can I offer to other creators to collaborate with or what am I really good at? What is my channel all about? What kind of Besides numbers, what value does my channel have to the larger community? So that's something I'm still thinking about but I'm really glad that this event kind of put that question in my head a lot more prominently. So those are the five things that I learned at YouTube Creator Day. I really loved this event and I definitely want to go to more so I hope YouTube keeps on inviting me back or putting a little notification on my YouTube dashboard. I hope they have more of these events and I want to go to them. So yeah, if you like this video feel free to give it a thumbs up or click that subscribe button if you want to see more from me and my journey on YouTube. And that's all I've got for you guys today. I'm Christy Lou. Till next time, matane!